Hi, this is One Unit, and today I'm watching the third BTS short film. It's called Stigma. Uh, in the last video, I said that I'll be talking about the first two BTS short films in this video. So I recently watched the explanations for those short films, and I realized that uh, I kind of got a spoiler. You know, I didn't know that Yoongi was dead, and they, these, these all. Uh, members of BTS are play actually playing the characters, uh, and uh, this storyline actually is part of that uh, part of those characters somehow. So uh, I'm still learning. Like uh, the fact that Jungkook was uh, j so th the thing with Jungkook was that he he kind of mixed his real life story with. Uh, with his character story, you know, the way he was talking about when he was 15 year old. So I, I think it was it was reality as well. I, I don't think that was just for the character storyline. I think he, he, he was reminiscing his past as well. And secondly, uh, I, I didn't know that Jimin was in a, a hospital there it means it must hurt. And uh, uh, one thing that I didn't understand was they showed that uh, Jimin had uh, drowned himself in the bathtub. So what I don't understand is, is he dead or is he alive? And I, I think with all that, I have another question. Is that since uh, Jimin was kind of missing J-Hope, Is J-Hope's character alive or not? That's also a question that I have. Mm, so so let, let's move on. I think I'll be watching more videos to understand more about it. Uh, so if you have any, any explanations, let me know in the comments, guys. I would be really, really thankful to you guys. I'm trying my best here to understand whatever I can. So let's jump into the third short film real quickly guys. Uh, I want to know what happens in this third one. Which character storyline are we gonna see from here on out. Let's go guys. It was the first fissure in the columns that had upheld my childhood which every individual must destroy before he can become himself. Such fissure and rents grow together again, hill and are forgotten. But in the most secret recesses, they continue to leave and bleed. Okay. That was a bit deep right there. Okay, so this is about V's character. So he got... He got like jailed? Who is he sitting with? So are they taking his credentials and everything? What is this music? Oh. these guys oh 
it reminded him of his friend i think the way he was drinking water in front of him right now i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry my sister so cute Why does this kind of mean like he's he's caged himself and everything that he loves is just going away? Okay, it, it ended actually. Oh no. Chalo and thoma na kuch sira. Oh, I forgot to turn on the captions. Let me just go back real quick. Gentleman at zero. What does that mean? Okay. So I ca- I kind of understand understood a few things from watching what was happening in the storyline in the video. Means I I don't know the previous part of. a uh, wee storyline uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna check it out as well but mm but a few things that i, I want to ask you guys is who who are the guys that that were with v hair and secondly there is some personal loss oh th- those we kind of lost those guys and that that's the personal loss that he is feeling right now and that's why he's acting out that that that's what he was doing with the with the art as a, uh, with the graffiti as well and that's why he got jailed hmm so the dog hair symbolizes kind of uh the loved ones that he had you know and how they got away he tried to hold on to them but he had to let them go i think it had to like the storyline has to be around this only i i could be wrong i could be very wrong i'm just speculating right now from what i just saw it was lovely to see it you know means now that i'm getting a hang of the storylines a bit it's uh, it's just all uh, processing in the mind okay oh so this is how it could be this is how it can be so w- one thing that i i want to know is will all these characters like come together oh that's what will happen in blood sweat and tears i get it now Damn, the way they created this a oh man wings wings is so good, w- wings is just amazing. Like if I think it like right, like that means they started with their own uh, their own storylines, and at the end they all came together. Like this this is like the Avengers, <laughs> like much better than Avengers though. Means uh, Avengers obviously never had any storylines. I'm sorry, Marvel fans. DC fan here, so yeah. So th- this is much better than that, I would say. And I kind of enjoyed it. Damn. All right, guys. I think we'll see what happens in the next one. Uh, I I wanna watch that as well. Also, I'll be studying more about what, uh, what all is going on in the background and what all I have uh I missed. So, for now. Thank you so much for watching guys I'll see you guys in the next one and I hope you guys enjoyed this and if you did don't forget to like and comment and subscribe I would really appreciate it and if you have any queries any explanations for me put them in the comments I would be really thankful so guys bye bye